Hey, welcome back there. So this is going to be the next episode here. Do a lot of random searches, uh, typically around 50 or so. And we're looking for gold boosting items, rares that are gold or purple that are really, really good. That has a high gold percentage, typically 10% or higher. We found quite a bit of um, legendary items already. So we're specifically looking for a cape that has a high percentage of gold. And then also um, boots and pauldrons. Pauldrons don't actually have gold. They have more defensive stats. We still need to find a very good pauldron. And right now it's a gem sale on the granny stuff, so it's a max of two gems. And it doesn't go up. Typically it goes up one every time you search. So this is a huge sale right now. Some of the items are bought with gold, but most of the higher end items are bought with gems. And they're roughly 500 gems every time you find a legendary item. Let's take a look at the hats. Decent hat. A um, little bit too low, though. Let's have found some gold hats already. We're trying not to buy crappy gear and then have another one better pop up in the future. So we're doing a lots of searches. You can see this is, I think, episode 13 or 14 on the searches. So I believe I've even passed up a gold cape that was like 9 or 8% gold boost, um, which I was kind of crazy for passing that up, but I feel that's a really low gold cape. I've seen one on the forums that has like 11% or something too. So the crazy thing is the stats are semi-random on here, so you can find um, you can find a purple item that is actually stronger than a gold item. So it's sort of keeping track. I was just taking a look at my gloves because I actually made a mistake there. I bought the gloves. Uh, they have a lot of blunt extra damage on them, but I thought 132 was the highest I'd seen. I've actually seen a 141 on the gloves, and I just had that in my notes, and it's just like, I'm getting tired. There's been so many of these. I've searched probably close to 700, 800 times now, seen hundreds, no, not hundreds, probably close to 100 gold items in those searches. So they're not too rare have wasted a lot of gems though, uh, at least you know a thousand gems searching. I don't think I've ever seen that hat before, that's a very just basic soldier hat. That's crazy, I've gone through so many things and there's still new items that are appearing that I've like never seen before. Yeah, those gloves are gonna haunt me now because I keep seeing better gloves. So the feed's lagging a little bit here. We'll let it catch up. I caught up. So this one's been a pretty bad um, cycle through. We haven't seen any gold items. But it's all luck, all random. There's nothing you can do to get better chances at items or gold items 
I'm waiting a whole like three or four days without seeing one gold item before uh, with a normal playthrough. I did quite a bit of searches during those couple days too. 7.9 up there. We have a sword down there. It's a very strong sword as well, 226, 127 poison. Fortunately, there's nothing that is really weak to poison in the end game. That's a cheap ring over there. So you can find good stuff for a fairly reasonable price as well. We already have a better ring. Uh, but just saying that's a very cheap ring for 8% gold boost. We'll do two more here. and then call it a day on this video. Cut here. So we didn't find anything good. Um, saw some new, unique, different things that I haven't really noticed before. Like this right here, this is a very unique and different outfit. I don't think I've seen that one before either.